Riverfront, a short story by Brian Corrigan. The burning glow of civilization made the rainy world as bright as the sun in the night sky. The lights danced and rippled in the puddles, disturbed by each drop from the heavens. They danced with such ferocity in these pools of reflection that one may have mistaken them for the wisps or wandering spirits of legends long past. The lights danced and danced on into the night, their joy unwavering. That is until she passed over them. The pool shattered into a million tiny fragments as she cast her shadow over it, the life within snuffed out by the dark's next victim. She glided by like a pale phantom in the night, producing that black reflection in her wake. As she passed the old tower, casting her wretched image against it, the bricks trembled and its round face shook, The strangled sound of an unholy scream belched from it. The phantom moved on, undisturbed by the inhuman wail. Finally, the pale phantom stopped. Beneath her feet, the abyss. An unending darkness that roared throughout eternity. It swallowed all the light that passed within its reach. Its victims never left any trace of their existence. She looked into it. She could feel the ever-flowing darkness boring its way into her soul, reading her like a book, as it had done to so many before her, judging her as if it had some divine right to do so. Although, in actuality, and some distant part of her mind knew this, This abhorrent absence of light before her was not one of God's creatures. She looked further into it, and it looked further into her. Amidst the chaotic roar of the Light Eater, she heard the souls of the lost scratching at the back of her mind, beckoning to her, calling her to join them. She broke her gaze stepped forward, and allowed the darkness to take her, whole. 